Before I demo this pick, I wanted to say that this is not a sponsored video and I'm not affiliated with Purple Plectrums in any way. I was simply intrigued by this product and I wanted to share my thoughts and opinions on it with you guys after having used it daily for four weeks. This $25 9mm beast feels like no pick I've ever held before. So let's get to the demos and I'll share my thoughts with it afterwards. So what are my thoughts? Well, plain and simple, I'm a convert. After using this Plectrum for almost a month, I can't imagine going back to a regular guitar pick for playing electric. I will say that I don't like to use it if I'm playing acoustic. Purple Plectrums offers a lifetime guarantee and free resharpening if needed. Huge selling point for me. I mean, $25 seemed like a lot of money for a Plectrum, but I'm sure that in my 10 years of playing guitar, I have spent well over $25 on picks, so it seemed pretty easy to rationalize. And of course, they have some more expensive models too if you really want to blow the budget. I work at a computer eight hours a day now and practice several hours a day after that, so I was getting some serious right hand problems and just needed to find something that was a little more ergonomic. Since making the switch to this pick, I've had no hand cramps at all. I mean, the large size, it just it fits my hand. It really just wants to sit in there nice. You can hold it in a few different ways than you would typically hold a pick. You use different parts of your hand where it, it'll give you some extra support and it almost kind of pushes back a little bit. I just, I like the way that it feels. It's a, a fantastic product. I also have not dropped this thing once since I started playing with it. And as a guitar player, you know that that's one of the uh, more inconvenient things of playing guitar. It did take a little bit of playing to get the muscle memory figured out of, you know, getting this bigger pick across the strings. A few hours maybe. And after that, it feels just like playing with any other pick. I noticed that the angle of attack makes a big difference in uh, the tone that you get when you're picking. It seems like if you're coming in uh, a little too flat with it, it'll rub and create this chirping sound that's a little bit unpleasant. But if you adjust your pick angle, and this is just you know muscle memory, it doesn't take very long to figure out, uh, you'll get a better tone and a nice, solid, consistent uh, plectrum sound as you're picking. I assume this is due to the super grippy nature of this uh, polyethylene that they use. Not that big of a deal, and it's, it's definitely worth it to have the extra grippiness. And I just, I really cannot state enough how awesome the texture is here. I mean, I, I'm really a big fan of this material. It, it feels unlike any other pick that I've used before, and I, I can't go back to a regular one after using this one. And, and with the bigger shape, it's just so much easier to relax my hand while playing and get rid of all that excess tension while trying to play fast. And I, I thought that some of my faster techniques would suffer for this, but it really, there's been no difference at all. And in fact, uh, some of the alternate picking and economy picking is kind of easier because this pick it just it wants to hit the strings. As a matter of fact, I was so thrilled with it that I ended up buying a second one because I didn't want the first one to get lost to the uh, pick void and this way I've got a backup. So yeah, definitely go check out purpleplectrums.com. They have a ton of styles and sizes to choose from. They handcraft every pick right there and ship it to you. It's going to come in these nice little purple shipping uh, packages. Uh, got a little thank you note and it just, you know, it feels like you're buying a, a high quality product for sure. You choose your options such as size, thickness, uh, what model you want, if you want to add any of the optics. And the optics are kind of cool. I mean, they don't really seem to do anything for the uh, playability of the pick, but you can see it's got nice little blue uh, dots there. And if I get it right in the light, you can see uh, there is some transparency to it. But uh, yeah, it's just personal flair. If you want to add something like that, you can. And it, it is a little bit of an extra charge. The first one was the uh, Scallon model. Uh, I found these picks from a Rob Scallon YouTube video and uh, thought if I'm going to try it, I might as well get the one that was built for his specifications. The second one that I got was the arrow shape. And you can see that there's a little bit of a difference in the shape, but the overall thickness is the same. They're both uh, the 9 millimeter. Uh, they also offer different uh, thicknesses. I think that uh, either 4 or 6 millimeter was the smallest, and then it seemed to go up to like 25 millimeter, which... I, 
guess that would just be like a rock but maybe one day i'll try that one out but for now i'm going to stick with the nine millimeters i mean overall i am extremely happy with my decision to try purple plectrums and i think that a lot of you will be too well, that's going to wrap it up for this video i appreciate you guys hanging with me until the end uh, definitely go check out purple plectrums i mean at least just look at their website and just check out the catalog uh, and hopefully you'll give them some business i think that you will definitely be happy that you did uh, i appreciate you guys watching all the way into the end and until next time